Good job, Molly. Welcome back to Classic Virals, and I do mean the video kind. Many a songwriter has always looked for inspiration when it comes to a good country tune, and Jay McLean was no different than anyone else. Unfortunately, when it comes to Jay, his folks never take to drinking, and well, his dog had never left him. So he was looking for a new angle, and he thought he'd found one. But unfortunately, it didn't go that way. We wanted to find out a little bit more about Jay's story, so we spoke to him earlier this week. My name is Jay McLean. On stage, my fans call me Schwally Polly. I have worked hard to make a living playing me tunes, and my main gig is covering Stompin' Tom, mixed with a bit of reggae and Scottish cheer. I've been watching lots of other boys playing the guitars on the YouTube and finding huge success writing songs that go against a man about injustice and corporate greed. So I decided to raise a bit of money to record a few tunes, film the sessions and become famous after my clever tunes went viral. It almost worked. Royalty check, pay check, rain check. Well, the first song I wrote was about a convenience store chain. I really wanted to let the world know that the convenience store that I shop at never had any haggis on a stick. They had jumbo dogs, they had other processed meat products, but they never had any haggis in the haggis tray. I realize I'm the only Scotsman in town, but they could at least kept their haggis on a stick tray filled. The convenience store chain advertises that they do, and that really put me off. Convenience. Convenience store chain, you got no haggis driving me insane. Convenience, convenience store chain, you lying bloody buggers cause me too much pain. Well, this song is one of my favorites, and when I play it live outside of the city market, it's a real crowd pleaser. I was sure that it was going to take off. But once I posted it, immediately I saw a few hits. Three people watched it in a matter of five minutes. I figured that this was a good start, but before I could even reach five hits, the weirdest thing happened. One of the top dogs at the head office at the convenience store chain posted a comment. Well, to top the story off, I arrived home later that day only to find at my front door from the convenience store chain's head office. It was a free box of yummy haggis. I must say that that store went above and beyond, so I had to take the video down. I mean, how could I continue to bash the convenience store chain when they were so kind and responsive to me haggis problem? How do I feel? Well, I'm a bit put off now that I can't be put off at the convenience store anymore. Therefore, my music can't go viral but I am willing to give it another go. I will write another song as soon as I become put off by something else. Convenience, convenience store chain. I'm a happy lad with no reason to complain. Convenience, convenience store chain. You responded so fast, my respect you did gain. Well, doggone it, that's one inspiring story. You see, that company did the right thing with Jay by listening and engaging with him. They could have been in a whole big pile of... Well, you know what I mean. You see, Jay didn't get himself a superstar hit, but when it comes down to it, anyone who gets a big old box of meat as a reward is well, they're okay in my books. You know, I have a feeling that Jay's gonna find some more inspiring stories because, frankly, I don't know whether all companies are listening and engaging like that one. We'll have to see. So, until next time, 
I'm Johnny C, and I want to thank you for watching Classic Virus.